Tom Kohler and the Marlins are matched up with Aaron Harang and the Phillies in game one of a doubleheader. In the top of the second, Miami has a 2-0 lead, and Christian Yelich will bat with the bases loaded and continue what would turn out to be a career game. Yelich, left center, falls for a hit. Scoring is Solano. It stays out in the outfield. A late start by Kohler, who now is arriving at third base. And it's station to station baseball. Yelich, an RBI hit. Solano scores and everybody moves up 90 feet. They're loaded with two outs and we'll get the lefty Cody Ashey, a more advantageous at bat. Here's the 2-2 pitch. Drive out toward le a right center field. Back goes Ozuna way back and it's going to bounce on the track and rattle around up against the out-of-town scoreboard. That's going to clear the bases. Around second Ashey, he wants a triple and he's in standing up and on one swing Ashey's put the Phillies right back into the game. A three-run triple. Marlins lead cut to 4-3. Went out in the Phillies fourth for the right fielder, Brian Bogusevic. Fly ball left field off Bogusevic's bat. Up into the wind. Back goes Dietrich at the wall. Jumps, can't get it. It's a game-tying home run. We're all even at four. D. Gordon has tied Billy Hamilton for the National League lead. He's got a piece of the title. He needs one more bag to have it all to himself. Gordon is running for third. There's the throw, he's got it. Into third and into score is D. Gordon. A stolen base and a throwing error. 58 bags for Gordon. And this game is tied and D. Gordon is gonna win his second consecutive stolen base crown. Martin Prado's had a tough afternoon, 0 for four. And comes up here with Yelich a tying run at first base. Prado down the right field line. Yelich has got great speed. It's into the corner. Yelich for third. Up with the ball, Bogusevic. Yelich will score. Prado's on his way to third, and he gets there with a triple. And Miami ties it in the ninth. So the intentional walk completed, first and third, and Ozuna's got a chance to get the Marlins out in front. Here's the pitch, and here's a base hit through the left side. The Marlins have the lead. Ozuna wraps a single to left. That scores Prado, and the Marlins are up 7-6 here in the ninth inning. And that would be your final in game one. Not only did D. Gordon's two steals give him the major league lead with 58, he collects two hits to give him an even 200 for the season. That also leads the majors, and Christian Yelich would finish with a career high, five hits and five at-bats.